So if you're like me and you have a Canon remote, you're probably wondering how you can pair it to your Canon. So let's go ahead and set up everything in the camera, how it's supposed to be done. First step, press on menu. Next step, where it says airplane mode, make sure this is turned off. Next one, Wi-Fi setting, make sure it is disabled. Next, Bluetooth setting, make sure this one is actually enabled. Press on OK, press on menu. After you do this, press on Wi-Fi, Bluetooth connection, and over here go where it says the remote, all the way in the bottom, press on it. Your menu might look actually a little bit different. Press on this once again. It says add a device to connect to, press on it over here, and it says pairing in progress. Now, bring your remote close to this, and you're going to be pressing on two buttons at the same time, the W and T. Now let's go ahead and press both of them at the same exact time and wait. You gotta wait. You see this thing flash over there? As it is done, it's gonna say paired with and then press on OK. Now, next step for you is to press on menu and we're gonna be testing and seeing if this actually works. So let's go ahead, go to the menu system. This thing has to be set in different ways. So if you're gonna be doing videos, Make sure it is powered on the video. Now we're going to be pressing on the record and the recording is in progress and press on OK. Now if you want to instead do the thing for shooting pictures, make sure the mode here is set to pictures. And next thing you're going to be doing is moving this all the way where it says 1. There was actually mode 2. Where it says 1 pressing on it once is not going to work right away. So to get this to work, what you have to do is to make sure you press on this button right here. And the button that you have to press is all the way on the side of the main. I'll show you right here the button you have to do. So the button you have to do is right there, this specific button here, and you're going to be pressing on this once. As you press on this once you have a menu that works exactly like this that's going to come up and when you have this menu you have to go all the way where it says different shooting modes and you have to do on the remote mode so this is the remote right here there's the sec 10 second timer there's the two second timer and there is the continuous timer let's go ahead and do the two second timer remote and press on to move it back and now press on it right here and what it does it takes the picture and voila you got the remote pictures done as well let's go ahead and shoot another one for us right here and when you want to go ahead and switch it around press on that button once again and move this all the way right there so it can resume its normal function Thank you so much for watching this tutorial. If you did enjoy this video, make sure you sub to this channel and smash the thumbs up button. Let me know below if this was helpful.